Hey guys, so in this video I'm going to show you a quick review um, of a Conair 2 inch heat rollers. And this is how the hair came out, but I'm going to go through the process of what I did, my thoughts, and my opinion. So stay tuned. But my hands are slipping off the wheel. Now the tables have turned. I'm going to do a little testing of the products. So on my husband's YouTube channel, we do unboxing from Amazon returns. Um, so there's a bunch of videos on his channel. Um, and I decided to try out one of the Amazon returns that we got from our last shipment. It is a health and beauty um, liquidation box and item I will be testing out is the Infinity Pro Conair. It is a two inch um, heat rollers and I'm just gonna try it out on my hair and I'll show y'all how it comes out. I'm not gonna do anything fancy just want to see if it works. Um, unfortunately this um, return did not come with a box and it did not come with instructions. So I'm just going to do it based off of my limited knowledge of how this stuff works. Um, I've used these things in the past, like junior high, high school, and I bought one of these um, about 10 years ago or so. Um, I don't remember what I ended up doing with it. I know I used it and then I guess I was disappointed it wasn't working the way that I wanted it to and so I guess I ended up selling it, returning it, giving it away, really don't remember but I just know that I don't have it anymore. Um, so I am going to give this one a try but make sure you jump over to my husband's channel, um, YouTube. Um, Koba Files, K-O-B-A-F-I-L-E, I think there's S, Files, plural, um, but yeah, so I'm going, it's warming up now, I'll be back when I'm putting it in my hair, and then I'll be back again with how it came out. Okay, so I sectioned my hair off down the middle on the top, and then the rest of my hair is down. Um, I guess I, I have medium length hair, I would say. I don't have long hair. I don't think it's short. But, um, so I brushed it with a Dima. Denman brush. And so what I'm about to do with pretty much no like holding products. I wonder if that's what I did wrong in the past. Um, I don't know, I really don't like putting holding products in my hair. If I do, I put it in after my hair styled. But I wonder if I should have been putting it in at the beginning. But anyway, so um, the rollers have been on for five minutes or so the lid is on and it's pretty hot not hot hot but like it's definitely not warm it's warmer than hot <laughs> so technical um when i opened it earlier before i moved it into here it smelled plastic so i'm not crazy about that but whatever so i'm gonna start putting some in my hair they are like two inches so hopefully it'll work well with my hair length because I would imagine if my hair was longer it wouldn't work so much 
um, or the results wouldn't be all that great. But I'm just going to maybe do an under roll with my hair for the ones on either side and the rest just do under. Like do an under roll and then a top roll with the other ones. So that's what I'm going to do. So I'm going to do the first one as a video. Oop, I forgot the clips, so I'll be right back. Okay, so this is my first okay. time ever using this product. Um, here goes the clips. Um, so yeah, let's go through this. I think this is a fair amount of hair for the size. That could be another thing what I did wrong in the past is that I used too much hair. Um, besides just... See, I got one full round and I'm going to clip it. Oh, I did it the, not the way that I wanted to do it. Okay, let me get another one. I guess I wanted to do it this way, not this way. So anyway. So yeah, I think working with rollers is more difficult than working with um chrome iron or flat iron see see maybe this is another reason why i stopped doing it i think it's been about 10 8 years since i've done these things So I'm going to be back. I'm going to do the rest of my hair. Her. And once it's all set, I'll um, be back. Okay. So I have seven of the eight rollers in. I have a spot for two more. So I'll have... A piece of hair not being warmed and that'll take a little bit I'm gonna take the first one that I put in out and put it in there to be warmed and then let that warm I'm gonna take the first one out that I did on camera with y'all I'm gonna take that out put it in there let it be warmed um, but I did three on the bottom, one in the front, and then in the crown part of my hair is broke that into two pieces. So I guess I would have needed nine because I am out of rollers. So yeah, I'm going to take this one out now. It feels kind of warm still, but whatever. And there goes a little flip. Okay, I'm going to put this in there, and I'll be back. Okay, so I started to, I took out the, the bottom row ones. Um, you can see the flip on this side. The thing about these things, for African American hair, or at least for my hair, I should say, um, it doesn't get to your roots, so if you wanted your root to... Um, be straightened. That's one thing you can do with a flat iron and still get a curl. Um, is start at the root, get that flat or a bounce or bump or whatever you want to do with it. Um, so yeah, the back of my hair feels very poopy. But anyway, so let me roll this last one with y'all. I'm sorry guys. All of it did not get in there. Hold on. Okay. 
Let's take this one out. Look at that layup. Curl. Right, I'm gonna finish taking these out and I'll be back again okay all of the rollers are out so I do have some curl I do have a little cool flip right here So, I I don't know. I, I definitely will probably need to spray my hair. Um, but yeah, I mean, it's fine. It's fine. I, I didn't really have too many expectations. It is a big roller two inches um and you know it did the job i first i guess you can say it does it is making my head kind of itchy because of the heat directly on the scalp um because of when it's sitting and it's still hot obviously um but yeah i mean this curls curled So yeah, I'll take some pictures so you can get a, I guess, a better idea of how it came out. But will I use it when I go back to work? Will I give it a try? Yes. Um, if I'm probably not going to keep it, I'll probably will probably list it for sale if it sells. It sells. It doesn't. I guess I'll continue using it here and there. Um, but my hair was flat ironed. Um, today's Friday. It was flat ironed maybe on. What day was that? Last Sunday? So my hair was already kind of. My like my roots aren't. Like I go. I don't know why I'm having a hard time talking. So, I do not get perms. I flat, I you know, wash my hair, blow dry it straight, and then I flat iron it. So that's why my roots look like this, because my hair is natural, wash and go, ready. Um, and so my hair's been flat for a few weeks, um, and then I flat ironed it. We flat ironed it again on last Sunday, I believe it was. Or no, actually, it was my son's birthday this week. So I think I did it on Tuesday. Um, so it wasn't that long ago. But anyway, it's okay. I'll use it. I don't know if I would have spent what I wouldn't have gone out and gotten it. Um, I don't know if I would recommend it. I'm pretty sure there's other products out there um, that I think I'm rambling. I'm not, I don't know if I'm really giving y'all any useful information. This is how my hair came out. Y'all kind of saw what it looked like before. I will probably give it another try. I am not crazy about it. I am not in love with it. I am not like, oh my gosh, I'm going to use this. Nothing like that. It worked nothing remarkable about it i had these things when i was in junior high um high school and i gave it another try in my early 30s or late 20s so it's fine i'm pretty sure it's good on my hair because of the amount of heat um but yeah i wouldn't spend more than twenty dollars on this thing. Okay, I'm done. Bye. Okay, guys, I went back in. 
I did a roller on the top and the back. Sorry for the camera. This did another one flipped out on the side because when I saw it in the mirror, mirror, I look flat headed, top flop headed. So not that this looks awesome, but yeah. So what I realized is that the amount of space, like storage, this thing is pretty big size. So when I'm not using it, it takes up a lot of space. I'm not sure where I would keep this. Um, but that's probably another con. Um, and the plastic smell is a con. You kind of have to wait and see, like, the the waiting is kind of like, you have to know what you're doing when you're rolling your hair. Like, this is not for somebody new at rolling their hair and not or having expectations of what your rolled hair would look like. Um, but, yeah. So, I'll be back again with all this out and we'll see what it actually looks like. Round two. September we met. I can tell by your smile. You hadn't been with a good girl like me in a while. Yeah, you were impressed. Couldn't leave me alone. Text me every time that you pick up the phone.